Why was Tom Cruise awarded the Legion of Honor in a secret ceremony? Tom Cruise, the Hollywood superstar known for his daring action roles, was knighted by French Minister of Culture Rachida Daddy with the Legion of Honor in Paris on July 26. The ceremony took place while Cruise was busy filming Mission Impossible Dead Reckoning Part 2 in Europe. This latest installment in the famous Mission Impossible series, in which Cruise has starred as the skillful and brave agent Ethan Hunt since 1996, added another milestone to his illustrious career. Just hours before the opening ceremony of the Summer Olympics, Olympic 2024, Tom Cruise received one of France's most prestigious medals, following in the footsteps of renowned artists, actors, and filmmakers such as Robert Redford, Martin Scorsese, and Clint Eastwood, who have also been honored with the Legion of Honor. This title not only celebrates outstanding artistic contributions but also recognizes Cruise's influence and dedication to the global film industry. French Minister of Culture Rachida Daddy, appointed by President Emmanuel Macron in January this year, posted a photo with Tom Cruise on social media. In the photo, Cruise proudly displays his medal, a symbol of high recognition. This small ceremony was kept private, and Cruise has yet to comment on the event. France is currently hosting the Summer Olympics, but the country is also experiencing political turmoil following a snap parliamentary election, making the organization of the 2024 Olympics extremely challenging. Tom Cruise is famous not only for that Mission Impossible series but also for a myriad of other cinematic works such as Top Gun, Jerry Maguire, A Few Good Men, and Rain Man. His roles are not only marked by bravery and determination but also deliver deep emotions, touching the hearts of millions of audiences worldwide. With a career spanning over four decades, Cruise has established himself as one of the most influential actors in film history. Although Cruz was not officially photographed at the Olympic opening ceremony, he attended alongside a host of other stars, including Sarah Jessica Parker, Matthew Broderick, Sean White, Nina Dobrev, Lindsay Vaughn, Serena Williams, Cynthia Erivo, Ariana Grande, Snoop Dogg, Chrissy Teigen and John Legend, Tyla, Queen Latifah, and Rebel Wilson. The presence of these top stars added grandeur and allure to the event. Celine Dion highlighted the opening ceremony with a powerful stage comeback, performing Edith Piaf's Him A L'Amour at the foot of the Eiffel Tower. Lady Gaga, one of today's most renowned music stars, kicked off the ceremony's entertainment with a tribute to French icon Zizi Jeanmaire and performed the song, Mon Truc en Plumes. This year's Olympic opening ceremony brought an extraordinary artistic atmosphere, bridging the past and present while honoring France's profound cultural values. Dear friends, we are updating you with the latest information from Paris about the Church of Scientology, of which Tom Cruise is a high-ranking member. To help you understand better, I will detail each highlight. David Miscavige, the leader of Scientology, spoke in Paris about an event he referred to as the New Church of the City. However, in reality, no new church has been opened. Scientology in Paris only has an organizational center and a celebrity center. Whenever Scientology opens a new building, they often refer to it as a new church. David Miscavige must always maintain the image that Scientology is an expanding organization, which is crucial for both its internal members and the external media. As for Scientology Paris, they have thoroughly prepared for the Olympics, hoping to capitalize on the event. However, in reality, they have not received much attention from the Olympic participants. Nonetheless, Tom Cruise still received recognition and awards, indicating the close relationship between Scientology and the activities in Paris. Many people might think that Scientology is merely a religious organization, but in fact, they have long-term strategies and plans. Tom Cruise is not just a celebrity, he is also a close friend and a loyal supporter of David Miscavige. Scientology has caused many families to break apart due to falling into debt because the sect constantly demands large donations. Many former members have publicly criticized Scientology for only taking special care of wealthy individuals. Specifically, according to Scientology's rules, the children of its followers must also attend a special training camp called the Sea Organization Sea Org. Oscar-winning actor Paul Haggis, who left Scientology, has criticized the harsh training of the Sea Org. He recounted that adults undergoing training had to endure strict regulations, and any violation would result in severe punishment. Most followers had to stay in the Sea Org for about 30 years, losing all contact with family and friends. According to The Telegraph, Tom Cruise's decision to have his daughter Suri join the Sea Org was the last straw that led Katie Holmes to file for divorce. Scientology is also known for being a litigious organization, especially against those who oppose it. One of its extreme stances is the policy of disconnection. According to this policy, members must cut off contact with any family or friends who are skeptical of or oppose the organization. 
Scientology has also faced numerous allegations of threatening and physically abusing its followers, organized fraud, and embezzlement of church funds. This sect has long been controversial, especially in Europe. In the United States, Scientology is often referred to as the religion of the wealthy or the religion that dominates Hollywood. Numerous famous movie stars have joined this sect, such as Tom Cruise and John Travolta. In Hollywood, tourists are invited to attend free screenings to introduce them to the sect. However, once they join, members are required to pay tens of thousands of dollars to achieve higher levels of enlightenment, including the state of clear, on the path to salvation. The initial cost is around $100 to learn basic teachings, but to reach higher levels, the average cost is at least $300,000. If you pursue the spiritual path towards the state of clear, you have to pay from a few thousand dollars to tens of thousands of dollars in the first few years, explained Presley, a former member of the sect. However, those who do not have enough money can work for the sect as a way to pay off their debt.